Hi, I'm Mr. Simons and in this video I'm going to deal with a viewer question and this question is can you explain what a hawkish stance is? And I read this and I'm like wow this is a really good question. I haven't heard this term for a long time and I bet this is really confusing to some people out there. What have hawks got to do with economics? Let's engage with this term. So what we've got is we've got hawks on one side and we've got doves on the other. So we've got hawks versus doves. Now this is used in the context of economics but it also is used in a lot of other fields in talking about say military responses. You've got your hawks and you've got your doves. And maybe that gives you a little bit of a clue about what we're talking about. Hawks are very fierce, they're sort of like violent and a bit warmongering and doves, they're the symbol of peace, they're really relaxed and peaceful creatures. So what we do is we take these animals and we use them to symbolize different stances on different issues. So if we then take this to economics, which is what we're talking about, that in terms of looking at a hawkish stance, we tend to talk about uh, people's or organizations' views in terms of inflation, that we have these inflation hawks. So the focus of a hawk is really to keep inflation really low, is to take all the necessary steps to make sure that inflation is nice and low and to be quite aggressive about it. And the way to be aggressive about trying to keep inflation low is by using interest rates. So a hawkish stance is the equivalent of a contractionary stance in terms of monetary policy. It's a stance of higher interest rates to really slow the economy down and squash inflation. If we look at the doves or a dovish stance, that's a much more gentler approach to interest rates. So it's being a little bit more accommodative, a little bit more flexible, having maybe lower interest rates to keep the economy going, um, maybe kind of being okay with inflation to a point and supporting employment. Hawks, they're there to fight inflation. They're the inflation hawks. The doves, they're much more peaceful and gentle. They're prepared to have more inflation if it means that the economy will still grow and people will keep their jobs. Okay, so hopefully this was very helpful for you in trying to understand these weird terms. Um, put any questions or comments in the comments and as always, thank you very much for watching.